Okay, uh, go into the Create Files and Code link, you type in a project name, which is usually the name of the company, followed by the date, then you put in the number of uh, videos. So now all you got to do is click, click the Add Files thing, it'll bring up a uh, file selection thing, you can't see it in this video right now, and then, uh, then you select all the files that are going to be used, and then this will upload all the files now. And as you can see, that can take some time. So I've, I've, the update I made was to make it so that uh, everything actually uploads now instead of waiting for uh, stuff to happen. So now everything's uploaded. You click continue, you go to the next page, and it brings up the... Uh, goes to the individual videos page. And so if you got more than one video, you can now select which uh, FLV, MP4, PNG, or JPEG goes into that particular uh, player. And then once you can do all that, you And then you click the continue. It goes to the setup of the uh, commands for the JavaScript. So, you know, you can change the width and the height and uh, all that stuff. Same as before. Just looks a little different and maybe easier to see stuff on. Then you can scroll down to the bottom. Once it's all done, you got everything set. You hit submit. You click on the demos. It brings up the page so you can view the demo on it. You can take a look at both of them in this case and make sure they look good. Then you go ahead and click the submit button. Then you type in the email that you're sending it to, which is in the order form, and then the name of the company, and then a note. If there's anything unusual, you can change that to whatever you want. And then you can either choose Model 2 Web or not Model 2 Web. And then just hit send, and there you go. It's all sent out.